Yo, what's going on everyone? This is Maximus here. Um, this is going to be another casual matches in the fog video. Um, and yeah, we're going to get right into it. So I'm going to be playing Spirit, who is one of my favorite killers. And my build for her is basically what it normally is. Nurse is Calling, Barbecue Chili, Sloppy Butcher, and Strider with Wakizashi Saya and Yaki Yoki Amulet for add-ons. And I'm using a black ward because I only have one amulet left, and amulets are pretty fucking rare in Bloodwoods. So, build decisions, like the reason why I use nurses, Spirit's terror radius is uh, 24 meters, and being able to see people healing just outside of your terror radius allows you to be able to phase walk over to where the aura reveals them, and get pretty much a free hit. Barbecue and chili, I mean barbecue and chili. Um, Strider is actually insane on Spirit. I don't value it too much overall, but on Spirit, because you need to use your ears in order to hear, like, the exact locations of survivors, it's a fucking godsend. And Sloppy Butcher, if I didn't have the add-ons that I did, I would not use it. I would use Ruin instead, but the add-ons that I do have for Spirit give her enough map pressure to where Ruin isn't really needed, and Spirit can definitely slug if uh, her map pressure is good enough. And that's pretty much why I have the add-ons that I do. Uh, the amulet is her best add-on other than prayer beads, but prayer beads are pretty fucking busted. Um, it gives her faster movement speed while phase walking, faster recovery, and longer duration. Oh! And we get her map. And the Saya basically is like ultra old school windstorm. So now what I do is spear is like use her power to like move around to the other side of the map to start off. I see a claw that right there. She went into here. And yeah. Nah. Are you okay? Are you okay? I'm gonna leave her on the ground because that I don't know what she's doing. I don't know if she, like, had to go AFK or something. I don't want to just put somebody on a hook who might be experiencing issues. So, what I love about Spirit, she has amazing mind game potential. Uh, depending on her add-ons, can have really great map pressure and is at least decent at slugging and being able to cause a snowball effect. In my opinion, she is one of the best killers in the entire game. Probably tied with Huntress. She is really good both in and in the chase and just. Hang on a second. Let me see if this. Strider helped me there. I don't know where the other people went. So I'm just going to place her on a hook. They healed the person that seemed to have been AFK. And yeah, it seems like people... It seems like she's actually doing shit now. Oh, just barely. The Saya, like, gives you such a ridiculous lunge. I love it. She's somewhere around here. I didn't hear any footsteps, hear any rustling. Jeez. Now I don't know where they went. Oh, hi there. Balance landing? Yep. So I don't want to tunnel you, but you're the only one I see. I kind of don't want to use my power. It feels like it would be too much of a waste and just take too long to set up. Just barely. She should have pulled the pallet down. Oh, and I'm a moron. She's exhausted, though. I know that for a fact. I'm going to leave her slug because I really need to get map pressure going. I heard a gen being worked on over here. Of course, it's like three Claudettes on this map. This is actually insane. 
You can just be so immersed on this map as Claudette. Or as anyone with any kind of dark clothing, for that matter. Hi. Sprint burst. I was wondering why I missed her. No reason to use my power right now. I'm eventually going to get this hit. And now I can use the power to catch up. And I can use Strider to pinpoint her location. Now I need to leave her slug to keep doing the map pressure stuff. But if they stay immersed, then this is going to be annoying. Honestly, as much as I love Spirit, this map is actually insanely bad. I need to get her back down on the ground. Now I need to cause a snowball. Hmm. Ah, she went that way. Hello. Thank you for dropping that. Thank you for sprint bursting right into my lunch. And I could hear a strider and the Saya just gave me so much. And I heard this gent worked on, so now I can keep the pressure going. I need to follow these scratch marks though. Hello. The fourth one got Lori up. I think I need to start hooking people. Looping with friends. Oof. And that's why I use nurses. Although I hit the wrong person. Feels bad. Love the Saya. I fucking love it. And I love Strider. Alright, now I should probably start hooking people. Everyone's already affected by Slop and Butcher. Well, I've caused them to. Okay. somebody over there. I see them now. The barbecue. Fuck. I need to get her down. She had dead hard on top of Bounce Landing. She is really laggy. Holy shit. <laughs> I tried to fake out using my power, but it didn't really work out too well. So they took the time to heal instead of rescue this one. Hello. You're still exhausted from dead heart. Now there's almost no 
way that they're not going to rescue this Claudette. Yep, exactly. So I don't want to tunnel because that's just boring. Though I hear her. Just barely. She ran into me. Feels bad. Um, yeah, I need to get somebody out of the game, unfortunately. So, feels bad. But I kind of do have to play a little bit mean. This map sucks. She couldn't have moved far. This is the same person who's been holding in their sprint burst this entire time. Yeah, exactly. Hmm. I heard Claudette. Claudette that was on the ground anyway. I might as well just kick this gen. Ah, over there. Okay. And yeah, I'll pick you up. Because I don't want you to bleed out. So she's over there. Both of them are away. I think Lori is back here. I thought I saw a cosmetic glitch out. Hmm. I probably didn't look enough over there. I don't know where anyone is. There we are. So now I gotta go back to the hook. Place you down real quick. There's Claudette. Which you're not the one that I really want to hit right now, but alright. I have no idea where she went. Strider actually fucked me up a bit there. I thought she was, like, directly in front of me. But that was wrong. Stick spins. Yeah, I'd rather get her out of the game and keep the other Claudette in. Because I don't want to tunnel that Claudette off of her. They're within barbecue range, or they're on gens. Either one. They also left three gens on this side of the map. And they took the time to heal. At this point, they're probably going to be looking for Hatch, because Hatch has spawned now. Hello. You're my last barbecue stack, so I'm just going to go after you. Just barely. Just barely. I'm a little too hesitant sometimes in my uh, phase walking. I'm seeing the grass rustle. And hey, the DS user goes down right next to a hook for me. Perfect. I'm assuming the other Claudette is on a gen. And Lori's gonna kill herself. Actually, no, there's no reason why, yeah. There's no reason why um, she would be on a gen at this point. This last, this last person is going to get the hatch. Yep, she was camping the hatch. All right, GG. I'm 
I really don't like Hatch because I feel like if you lose, it, like if your team loses, you should lose with the team. Like that should be the whole point of, uh, hang on, let me answer his question. Yeah, slugging, it really depends on the scenario. Oh, she did have a instant heal. Slugging really depends on the scenario. Um, like, in order to save time, uh, like, you'll be wasting time putting somebody on a hook, and that time could be used, like, chasing somebody else and uh, downing them. And if you can get the snowball rolling, it could just end the game right then and there. But, at worst, if you're effective at slugging, then it causes people to get off of gents to heal people off of the ground. And by doing that, it actually gives you time uh, to basically uh, exert map pressure, put somebody on a hook, and not worry about the gents being rushed through. On killers who have, like, good map pressure, but aren't exactly the best at uh, ending every single fucking chase as soon as possible, like Nerfs or Hillbilly, I do find a lot of use in uh, Sloppy Butcher. Which, the only one other than Spirit I can really think of off the top of my head that would fit that criteria would be Wraith. And that's if he has a... Uh, if he has um, a Windstorm add-on. Without the Windstorm add-on, though, then he still needs Ruin. Freddy is actually really good at using Sloppy instead of Ruin, though, as well. Because A, he's actually just really good at slugging in general, and B, he can't really defend a total worth shit. So I like using Sloppy Butcher on him instead of Ruin. And also, he's a 115 movement speed killer. It's not like he has terrible mobility or anything. Anyway, yeah, so that's pretty much how I try to play Spirit. I try to, um... I try to use the add-ons to help give me enough map pressure to where I can actually slug people and get the snowball rolling. Um, it worked really effectively here. If hatch wasn't a thing, then it would have been a 4K, but I mean, I've complained about hatch way too much. For me, hatch is just like, it's a free escape for somebody when they should lose with the rest of their team. And for me, it's more of like a team-oriented thing as to why they would, uh, as to why they would, um, either deserve to escape or deserve to, uh, die. But, I mean, the hash is a thing. They haven't reworked it. It's a 3, it's still a 3k instead of a 4k. Who the fuck cares? Unless if I was, like, super sweaty and tryhard. But, again, this is called casual matches in the fog. So, I mean, it is what it is. So, I was debating between playing Spirit or playing Myers for this one. And since I chose Spirit for this one, I'm going to do Myers next. Um, and I can't wait to do that one because Myers is my favorite licensed killer. And is probably my favorite iconic horror movie villain of all time. And to see him in a spot where he's actually like mid-tier at worst in this game is actually really cool and he's really fun to play and i feel he's the best designed killer based off of like the lore that he, from the universe that he comes from anyway thank you all for tuning in hit that subscribe button if you like what you see this is maximus signing out have a good one